Hello friends, Dennis here and welcome back to another episode of Petriam. Oops. Uh to the uh uh pepper Wait what? Are these off? That's not good. How? One, two, three. One, two. Oh, that's how. Oh. Was that a thing? I'm gonna correct this then. <laughs> it's easier to correct this. Um, this is basically gonna be a 24.5 video. Um, where we're not really going to be building anything. We're, we're going to be working on a um, on this thing. And we're gonna talk about the lore, which I started to talk about last episode, but never really got into. Uh, the lore that I was supposed to add last video that I completely forgot about because of what happened. I don't really remember what I what I needed to take care of, but it was something. Um, yeah, so let's let's get into that. Uh, the lore for Brigande is that it used to be trading town, a town where traders and merchants would gather up and start selling their stuff to people who live there or buying stuff from people who live there. Um, there's gonna be a little bit of a farm close by where uh, the, the, the merchants would kind of go in and uh, buy food and kind of good that kind of good stuff. Um, but the roads started to become dangerous. Uh, it was uh, bandit bandits started to take over, and they needed to change out what they were doing. So the city closed itself for merchants for a little while, uh, trying to figure out what they could do about the th this problem that they were having. Uh, and they basically figured out that if they closed their doors for for the merchants for a while until they could um, get a safe passage for the merchants. And that did take some time and they landed on one way to do it and that was basically uh, going in and making the town a scholar town. So they they would stop being a merchant city and start being, let's see, we're just gonna go ahead and pick these up, and start being a uh, town of um, scholars, basically. That, that's basically what happened. They um, did that because, well, they wanted safe passage for their merchants, right? And if they were going to make this uh, town into a school city, uh, teaching everything from children to grown men how to write, uh, math, uh, how to make weapons, that kind of stuff, um, theology, religion, basically, uh, that they they would get support to get some uh, more guards from the other kingdoms to make sure that the children going to and from the school would get there all safe, right? So they changed into being a scholar city and um, th that worked for a while. But uh, now, the bandits bandits in the area have gotten so bad that uh, people are no longer daring to send their children to their schools. And the bandits in this lore being enemies like zombies, skeletons, those kind of things. That, that's at least what we're gonna consider the bandits as to begin with. Uh, that's basically the um, the lore for Brigande thus far. I may come up with more, I may alter it a little bit, but I think that's good. 
I think that's a good beginning. And now what we need to do is go in between here and get all of this, uh, all of this stone out so we can go ahead and throw, let's see, there we go, planks in there, right? I think that would be a good thing. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did enjoy, don't forget to hit the like button. No, you know what? You know what to do. You know what to do if you like it. Thank you. Um, thank you for watching, and I will see you guys tomorrow. Okay. Bye-bye.